What is good on my dudes out there? It's your boy Roxel and welcome back to Honey Pop. So I don't know exactly what happened, but um, I guess when I turned off the game last time, it didn't save all of my progress. So um, we actually just met Brooke again. So I am going to just get right back into it and um, I'll talk as I go. But uh, basically what we're doing is we are going to try this one again because, uh, you know, we messed it up last time. I can't and I'm also going to try some before, new stuff. So I'll um, just ask. I know you've had sex with a porn star, but have you ever had sex with a prostitute? <laughs> oh, these also. So when I was editing the last Honey Pop video, I realized that I didn't always read out all of the uh, lines, which was really stupid. And also, like with the dates, I think um, there's some other stuff that I really need to try because if you remember the last video, I did god awful and I messed up a lot of stuff. Let's just get right back into this. So I'm not proud of it, but I did pay for sex once in a moment of weakness. Ew, no, sorry, but I'm not letting my junk get anywhere near that mess. Are you kidding me? Hundreds of them. I call my apartment <laughs> Hooker Haven, Jesus. Okay, so I'm thinking one of these two. Uh, this is so dumb, I'm doing it anyway. Hey, nobody is perfect. Hey. Besides, a girl's gotta pay the bill somehow, right? <laughs> Are you saying that you were a hooker at one point? I'm- <laughs> Okay, let's just talk to Brooke. So tell me something. Mm -hmm. Have you ever had to use an aid to help you get ready for sex? Use an aid? Like Blue Chew? I'm not ashamed to admit that I've taken pills for that. Not even once. I'm ready to go at the drop of a hat. Everyone occasionally needs a little help getting up and running. I don't like the definite answers. It really looks like the definite answers are the worst ones. I'm going for this. Speak for yourself, kid. <laughs> Damn it! This is something that I wanted to try in the last video, um, because like I always notice that when you go for a date, it always adds to uh, stamina. I'm gonna talk again and see what happens. If there's something you wanna ask me, don't be shy. Your Ara Ara voice is not making that easy, Jesse. What's your favorite thing to drink? Movie genre, kind of weather. Let's go with movie genre, I guess. I'm a sucker for a good romance movie. I used to wish someone would sweep me off my feet like that. Oh well. Let's try this Why again. Why are you looking at my face when my boobs are right here? <laughs> well, might as well uh, ask this. Isn't it obvious? My husband spent a lot of money on this rack, and they're worth. <laughs> Every penny. Oh god. <laughs> now this is my kind of girl. <laughs> I also want to try um the uh, date gifts thing. Um I am really bad at this. I know this is a special item, so I don't want to get rid of it. Let's go to the store and see how much I can get. Converts all broken hearts into towel. That is actually amazing. I need to figure this stuff out more clearly. So this one gives stamina. It's okay to indulge every once in a while. And then to you, 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 yeah, I would say so. Uh, that is so good. <laughs> Why did you have to say it like that, though? So hot shot. I think right. it's time you tell me. Sure. Just how many girls have you been with? <laughs> I'm a, I'm a virgin. I'm saving myself for marriage. Well, we already know that's bullshit because I have been with her and her daughter. I don't really keep track of that sort of thing. It has to be triple digits by now. <sighs> you don't? I thought everybody did. I used to, but I lost a track years ago. <laughs> Honestly, my pussy has seen so much action. I feel like I'm starting to go numb down there. <laughs> well, that's kind of lame. Let's see here. <laughs> Baggage learned busted veg. Jesse won't feel sexuality matches at all unless they are at least four of a kind. Okay. That is very helpful to know, so save that for Brooke, if anything, but why is it a roast beef sandwich? I was wondering when somebody was gonna suggest something fun. Well, let's do it. Rooftop lounge, okay, okay, let's do this. I love it up here, don't you? You can see almost the entire resort. <laughs> Good stuff already. I need to like really be careful about like which moves I make because like Broken Hearts was such a bitch last round. That was supposed to go to Jesse. <laughs> Woo! Look at you. Exactly. I'm the best, right? Nope. My, my, my. 13 moves, but we can get more. Now we will give you. Feel free to spoil me more. <laughs> 
I'll uh, try and remember. Oh my god! Now I'm getting shit from you too. Fuck. Are you gonna behave yourself this time? I'll behave myself. I promise. Sorry, mommy. Do we have another talent match? Woo! There we go. We're getting better. Not bad, kid. Thanks. I might just have to let you take me out again. Really? I have to admit, Jesse, you've piqued my interest. Oh, why do you say that? I'm not usually interested in women my age, but I might have to make an exception. Hey, all right, as long all as right. You're to throw some of that sugar baby money my way, I'm sure we can work something out. <laughs> Honestly, I could use the work. <laughs> All right, all right. Wait a minute, have we met everyone? Yeah, we've met everyone, so it should be pretty easy now. <sighs> Sweet home Alabama. I wish it would just stay this dark out forever. Really? You like the darkness? Let's give this to you. You're not like into watching girls eat, are you? <laughs> no, I'm not. Okay, we'll give this to you, and uh, let's see here. Sorry, I gotta. Take this off. There we go. Give to a goth girl in game plus one style EXP. Well, goth girl. Wait, you actually like understand my style? That's like cool. <laughs> she just doesn't know what to say. All right, let's talk to you. Where did I put my inhaler? Uh, oh, you got yeah, asthma? I left it in the hotel room. What do you need an inhaler for? Should we go back and get it? Don't you hate when that happens? I'm gonna offer to go and get- we know what it's for. Uh, I don't know. I like, really don't want to go all the way back. Whatever, it's fine. If I have an asthma attack, I'll just die. And then everybody will be happy. Not me. Or your cousin. Moves on Lillian that include multiple matches or a four of a kind match will cause her to lose an additional one stamina. God damn it. That is so bullshit. Man, you know what's crazy? What's Believe crazy? Believe it or not, I actually almost got married once. Really? I was super young and naive and I thought I was in love. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine? I mean, it's a little crazy. What made you change your mind? You married can't even picture it. Uh, I guess I should return this ring then. <laughs> Don't bullshit, dude. I know, right? I used to be a good little girl too. Oh, Glad really? I grew out of that. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have started my band, and I definitely wouldn't have discovered my modeling career. Really? Nah, it's the single life for me. You can't lock this bitch down. <laughs> Commitment issues. If you stay focused on Ashley for four consecutive moves, she'll become uncomfortable and matches directed at her will be negative. Both of them have really shitty baggage. Wouldn't it be funny if I like choked on this and died? No, it would not. Hey, as long as you're paying. <laughs> you used that line last time. Come on. Royal suite. Do you think anybody was ever murdered in this room? That'd be cool. <laughs> so I can't stay on you for more than four consecutive moves, and I can't do any four-of-a-kind stuff with you. Or, well, I can. It's just a stupid idea. <laughs> oh, sick. Oh, stupid fucking asthma. <sighs> Still worth it. Actually, let's give this to you. Could you, like, not? Well, that sucked. Now I'm, like, scared to do any move. Jesus. Two... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, is, there a reason the breaks, I'm being ignored? is there a reason you're being- Yeah, because you, like, got pissed off at me. Oh, man, we used so many moves, but we haven't done- I haven't really made any progress. Don't get cocky. Trying my best here, but, you know, trying hard not to piss either of them off, but it's getting difficult. Five moves left, Jesus. Yep, I failed it. Whatever. Well, that sucks. Fuck! Weak, dude. Weak. Come on, I know you can do better than that. Yeah, I know that too. That's why I'm a little bit frustrated. What do I have for gifts? Parish this afternoon. Okay, so... Most favorite is romance. Uh, can I find details? Right, okay. I 
I thought that was like secondary. Are you kidding me? That's the least favorite? I am dumb as hell. Okay, well there, there's that. Boardwalk, nice. Hey guys. Millions of viewers? Fascinating. And what do you discuss during your video broadcast? Well, it's a beauty channel. I mainly do makeup tutorials. What can I say? Girls love makeup. <laughs> yes, I found that to be true. Makeup is an interest that I share as well. I see that. I could, um, probably give you some tips if you want. <laughs> oh, is there something wrong with the way I've applied my makeup? No, no, you look great. It's just <laughs> eyeshadow and lipstick. It's an interesting statement. Should I have gone instead with perhaps orange and green? Um, that's an option. <laughs> Maybe it's best just to stick with the white for now. <laughs> oh, man, she's tried so hard to be polite, but oh my god, it's just not working. All right, let's talk. My mind is open for all those who wish to explore it. Okay. What is your favorite holiday flavor ice cream way to exercise? She's going to say yoga, I bet. I've taken to the sport of boxing. Boxing. It works wonders not just for the body, but for mind and spirit as well. I thought you were going to say something else, but okay. How do I pick a good question then? Forgive me, but I'm dying to know more about you. Awesome. What's your dream wedding like? She's traditional. I don't care. A Vegas wedding would be fine by me. No. I'm going all out with a huge venue, flowers, doves, the works, a small wedding in the backyard with family and close friends. Oh, shit. Okay. Yes. It's settled with soulmates. You <laughs> my dream wedding, even down to the doves. Down to the doves. All right, let's talk both I'm times. getting a reading of someone nearby. I have no idea who, though. It's a past filled with hardship and betrayal. This one's walled herself off to avoid being hurt again. That sounds a lot like it might be Nora. You know you're probably thinking about Lillian. As soon as you started saying that, I thought, this has to be Jesse. <sighs> uh, hardship, betrayal, this one won't have Nora. I had a strong feeling you were going to know this name. Let's this is a bad idea. What's going on inside that cute head of yours? <laughs> when do you think a person should be ready to settle down? I don't see anything wrong with getting hitched in your 20s. You ought to be married by the end of your 30s at least. Nowadays it seems like people are waiting f until their 40s. Traditional would be end of your 30s or in your 20s. Uh, one of these two. I'm not gonna lie too much. Hmm, well, different folks, different strokes. Damn it, this one. Thank you. I will accept your generous offer of food. <laughs> Why was that hilarious to me? Okay, okay. Let's try uh, one more. So uh, we need stamina. So uh, let's let's try this one here. Why can't more men be this considerate? That's a good question. Let's uh, go for the date. Yes, this is a perfect time. The air is thick with the essence of love. This is dope. I can't wait to see what you have in store for us, lovely ladies. You love flirtation. Do not like talent. You like talent, do not like sexuality. I should have figured that out a lot sooner, but uh, yeah, I am I am dumb. Where are all the good moves? <laughs> That's an idea. Yeah. Good heavens! Yes, yes, I see. Aha. Oh, gotcha. You. Eight moves. We getting there though? Three moves? Oh boy, come on. We getting. We gotta get there, though. Lovely. One move. Oh, come on. So fucking close! I'm confused. Don't the butterfly people teach you how to do this? Yeah, they do, but, um, still a little difficult. Let's try one more and we'll go for this one. No way. Get the fuck out of here. You're 40. You don't look a day over 30. You flatter me. I do my best to keep up my appearance. Seriously, you could be a model. Take it from me, you definitely have the look. <laughs> well, I can't take all the credit. 
My plastic surgeon is a real miracle worker. <laughs> ah, you've had a little work done. A little work done? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I suppose you could say that. Jesus. That, that was easy. Hey, you're gonna feed it to me too? <laughs> <laughs> no, I wasn't planning on it. Delectable. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just going with it. Let's see here. Talk. <sighs> there goes my phone again. My husband's been trying to call me nonstop. That man. I specifically told him I needed some time away from him and the kids. Jesus. Why don't you just answer the phone? Why exactly are you still with them? Have you considered filing for a divorce? I really hate all three of these answers. Oh my god. Well, he's a good father to my kids. And the nine-figure bank account doesn't hurt. Don't get me wrong, my husband's a good man. <laughs> He's just so boring. I can't say his money doesn't allow me to have my fun, though. Gold digger bag, you learn. Brooke will take will take one move for herself anytime her date receives a date gift, unless she's exhausted or upset. Oh man, Jesus, that's so bad. Is it up to me to kill the awkward silence again? Okay, let's see. Do it Have then. Have you ever tried to suck your own dick? <laughs> <laughs> I never felt the need. I have plenty of girls for that. Many, many times. Unfortunately, no. Yet, <laughs> of course, and successfully, I might add this one. <laughs> If you haven't tried it, you're lying. I suppose I can pencil you into my extremely busy, important person schedule. <laughs> Jesus. Be a little bit more cocky. So this oh, wow. Is your plan to get us wet, huh? <laughs> oh, I cracked myself up. Clearly. Um, I think I might have to do a little bit of censoring. Not bad. My, my, my. Whoa, that was good. Okay, so there's the fox plush and then that one. I want to give sentiment to you. Just like my husband. I may have already fucked this up. Wow. Four. Oh, uh, sorry about that. I uh, didn't mean to be an ass. <laughs> oh, there's a sentiment mash. Okay. Now I can give this to you. Mm, what else you got? Look at you. <laughs> That was good. Okay. Blended. Woo! We almost there. Almost there. Oh, if we get one more good match, then we win. Will this make her upset? No, it won't. And with that, we win. Yes! Just made it. Close one. You're lucky I was here to save us. <laughs> Honestly. So, Brooke, I'm curious. Just what kind of work have you had done? You name it. I've had a facelift, a tummy tuck, a boob job. The list goes on. Jesus. Ever had anything done to the old curtains? Of course. My surgeon calls it the virginity restoration procedure. <laughs> For real? Oh, now this I gotta see. I'm sure we can find some way to... Arrange that. Well then, okay. <laughs> well, I think that's a good place to end off this next episode. There are lots of fucking people who haven't met yet. Well, we got lots of work to do the next episode. I hope you liked this video. If you did, smash that like button. Subscribe to join the Legion. And I will see y'all in the next video.